KPFNN. The Tiger Financial News Network. TFNN Headline News Update. Good morning, everybody. I'm Tommy O'Brien coming to you live from TFN 10 a.m. update 30 minutes into, into the trading day. And we got markets accelerating higher, folks, putting things on a 15 minute basis. We just blew through the 618 of that move lower yesterday. We're coming right into where we were towards the opening bell yesterday. You had overnight lows of about 3,800 lows yesterday afternoon. 3804 to be exact right now we're trading at 3856 with the s p's up 1.3 percent nasdaq 100 we're coming up to the highs of yesterday uh so much for 10,750 as we were yesterday you're approaching 11,000 this morning with the nasdaq 100 up 1.8 percent the dow right now up about seven tenths percent up 258 points and we got the russell up 1.7 percent at 1762 bitcoin holding up relatively well 16,600. we got crude with a 77 handle, little volatility in both directions in that crude market. We were up above 78. We had a 77 handle earlier in the session. We're trading at 77.86. Gold contract catching a little bit of a bid, up by about $5 at 18.20 this morning. We jumped to notes and bonds. Slightly higher price, but in the context of the moves we've had recently, pretty negligible. You got the 10 year up four ticks, you got the 30 year up eight ticks right now. Back to the 10 year, I've been talking about this on my program, folks. You put this thing on a daily. Pretty undeniable, the rollover, we're getting right at the top of that channel line, folks. That channel line, we bumped into it when we reached a high of about 115.11, and we are three full points below that price level. And boy, you ever get a run to the lower part of this channel line, watch out in terms of higher yield coming at you. We talk about the dollar index. We jump over to the dollar index on a longer term basis. Basically pulling back now, I have to go back even a little bit further than this to get the full move. That move started, folks, in the middle of 2021 from a price of about 90 up to 115. We're sitting basically just under the 382. That's also the area of the high we had from May of this year in the dollar on a shorter term basis, the dollar index, a little bit of volatility in both directions. You trade lower from where we were yesterday, but look at the spike we're just getting in the last 15 minutes or so. You have the dollar trading higher right now at 104.16. We jump over to the volatility index this morning, 2174. And let's check out some of the fundamental news we got this morning. Jobless claims rising 9,000. I kicked off my program with this, folks, last hour. If you didn't catch it, keep your eye on continuing claims. An undeniable acceleration to the upside. Continuing jobless claims, probably something we need in this economy to tame inflation. Stay tuned, folks. Basil did his program at 8 o'clock. That's coming up right now. Live programming after that. Have a great one, folks.